Avil will find a way. A warm and cheerful good morning to respected father, principal, Jodi, sisters, teachers, non-teaching staff, parents, and all my dear Zayvans. Today, I, another part of class 9B is going to host this wonderful morning lesson. Prayer is the raising of one's mind and heart to God. So let us join our hands and close our eyes for the beautiful prayer sung by my class. Happy morning, my dear students. Let us begin this day with a small prayer. Almighty God, source of life, we worship and praise you. You are the truth and origin of all knowledge. Bless us that we may study well, obey our parents and teachers, and be honest in our behavior. Lead us from darkness to light. Bless our studies and enlighten our intellect. Grant us the grace to seek truth and make us truly wise. Thank you, Father, for your prayer. School anthem feels us how proud we are to be Zayn, right? So now let us all sing together the pride of our school. Scenes of a childhood, scenes of a youth, scenes of a childhood, Scenes of a youth, the school we love and cherish. The school we love and cherish. Preparing us for life's rough space. Preparing us for life's rough space. Send Zavius forever, we will ship. Send Zavius forever, we will ship. God bless our dear old school. God bless our dear old school. Our principal father teachers of our principal father teachers of our playmans, students, all other friends, our playmans, students, all other friends who will write our names in mortar. Who writes our names in water? Send Savior, Savar, I'm a meet your friend. Send Savior, Savar, I'm a meet your friends. God bless you is a daily prayer. God bless you is a daily prayer. We humans always think what other people think about us. So now I would like to call my friend Mahi Thakwani to put light on the topic. Don't think what other people think about you. Good morning, respected father, principal, sisters, teachers and all my dear friends. I, Mahi Thakwani of Standard 9B is here to speak on the topic. Don't think what people think about you. Who's in control of your life? Who's pulling your strings? For the majority of us, 
its other people society colleagues friends family or our religious community first of all we all are afraid of disapproval am i dressed right will people laugh at my accent will i look stupid will i make a mistake when we feel that others think badly of us it makes us feel bad and so we try to avoid this if we are constantly worried about what other people think you will never get to go where you need to go in life people think that the problem is technology or social media but the real problem is not technology or social media it's the human nature we are wired to care about what other people think stop asking people what they think of you stop worrying about their opinion if it doesn't matter if someone else think you should go a certain direction with your work since you know the path you are on you have one life to live so why would you spend it worrying about other people opinion do whatever you want be whoever you want thank you and have a nice day ahead thank you mahi for your amazing speech we all humans have different types of talents which makes us unique so now i would like to invite my classmate chirdeep sarvaya to tell us more about different people have different types of talents sisters teachers and all my dear friends myself shudip sheth sharma of class 9b is going to present a speech on the topic different people have different talents a talent is a skill that someone has to do something which is difficult it is an ability that someone is born with people say that they are born with a talent different people have different talents such as music dancing sports and then other skills even if someone has talent they have to work hard to perform it well some people become quite good at some skills even if they do not have talent but if they are willing to do hard Different, spe- different talents have different speciality in it and also talent is a natural ability to do something well and it is a great artistic at last i'm trying my speech with a beautiful thought everyone has their own talent it's up to the individual you see what you can actually do thank you and have a nice day ahead thank you shivdeep for informative speech now i would like to call my friend roshni nayar to say a sweet story on happiness A very warm and cheerful good morning to respected father principal sisters teachers and all my dear friends I Roshni S Nair of standard 9B is going to tell a short story it goes like this once about 70 people were attending a seminar suddenly the speaker stopped saying and started to distribute a balloon to each one after that he asked them to write his or her name on that after he took all the balloon and put it in the room After 20 minutes the delegates were asked to go in that room and find their own balloon within 10 minutes after that they were frantically looking for their own balloon they were pushing each other they were colliding on each other and there was a utter chaos after 10 minutes no one could find their own balloon then the speaker said take any random balloon you get and give it to the person whose name is written on that Within a minute all were holding their own balloon. At last the speaker said, "This is exactly happening in our life. We are extremely looking for our happiness without knowing where it lies. Actually it lies in the happiness of other people. If we will share our happiness with them, then only we will also get the happiness which we deserve." And this is the human motto. Moral of the story, if we share our happiness with others, then only we will get the happiness which we deserve. By this I would like to end my story hope you all have a wonderful day One thought can change our whole day so now I would like to invite my friend Prachi Keswani to say the thought of the day A very warm and cheerful good morning to one and all present here I am Prachi Keswani of class 9B is going to deliver a thought of the day God has given us 100 reasons to cry but say god that we have thousands reason to smile i want to explain my thought life has given us 100 reasons to back off but feel as if we have lost everything that we ever had looking around you will find plenty of reason to smile and laugh you should not focus on the negatives of the life but you should focus on the positive things of the life thank you thank you raj your thought was really positive and made our day Class is an action that symbolizes our loyalty towards our nation. So now I would like to invite our class teacher Nisha Ma'am to lead us with the pledge, and I also request you all to please stretch your right arm for the pledge. India is my country. All Indians are my brothers and sisters. I love my country, and I am proud of its rich and varied heritage. 
I shall always strive to be worthy of it. I shall respect my parents, teachers and all my elders and treat everyone with courtesy. I pledge my devotion to my country and its people. My happiness lies in their well-being and prosperity. The National Anthem of a country represents its history, tradition and belief of its nation and its people. So let us get ready for the National Anthem. Last but not the least, I would like to thank respected Father Principal Jobby for giving us this wonderful opportunity to speak in front of our whole school. Thank you.